What's happening, YouTube? This is Antibody with Team Zonotic, and I'm bringing you a brand new dual commentary. This one is between Solid and Dodger on the map Final Rage. I spectated this map, or uh, this match rather, uh, yesterday. Um, so it's my POV, which means I'm going to be switching between uh, the different players' point of views, which is great and doesn't often happen for us. Let's get into it. Begin. All right, we're starting off on Solid's POV as he gets the Mega Armor spawn. Gets both the Devastator and the Vortex. Quite useful there. Okay, Dodger peeking around. He is in possession of the Mortar. Solid doing a smart thing and trying to homestead the Vortex over there so Dodger doesn't get it. Dodger great with the, I don't know how you want to call it, the multi-spam, just tossing like a tsunami of damage as, you know, wherever he goes. Uh, so Dodger with a Mortar and Devastator is, is deadly, but Dodger with a Mortar, a Devastator, and a Vortex is even more deadly. Uh, so it makes sense to try to item control the Vortex when it comes to him. Solid coming from an insta background. I expect some, some really good twitch aim here. As they, they both tie the match up at one. Just a little past one minute in. And we switched over to Dodger. Dodger not choosing to take any chances there. Instead, going for the curved rocket to see if he can get some free damage there. Not a bad move. Uh, this map, just critical with the sound cues. There's shards in a couple of locations, but they're dispersed in such a way that you know, the person very familiar with the map layout can determine exactly Triple where kill. the opponent is just by you know listening acutely. And as I was talking, Dodger takes the lead. He now has a two-frag lead here, just about two minutes into the match. Hey, Dodger in possession of the Mega Armor. I think there's a bit of a delay on the Mega Health, which is something that you'll see a lot of the pro-level players do, is, is delay the Megas so that they have a better opportunity to get both of them. Or, you know, just to confuse the opponents. That works too. Because what you may often find is if someone does someone else a, a good amount of damage, they won't necessarily show themselves for the next Mega Iteration, and so they will have timing from the last cycle. So it benefits you greatly to just give it a couple more seconds, so they'll be waiting on the spot while you can roll by and have a couple of seconds to get the frag. So speaking of frags, Dodger extends his lead four to one here, three minutes in. So we have a good split on on the Megas, about you know an eight second difference. Not quite what you'd want for a lot of leisurely movement about the map, but it's sufficient to get both. Solid, however, protecting that that little corridor or the little closet where the Mega Health is very well. He's able to take the Mega, discourage Dodger from encroaching in the space. Always a good move, and and Dodger rightfully giving Dodger, I mean uh, Dodger giving a solid, rightful amount of respect in choosing not to push through that window. Rage. Both players have just tremendous damage potential here, as now we see Dodger in possession of both items. Nice combo with the Devastator to Vortex. So for, we're four minutes in and Dodger maintaining his five frag lead here. Looks like he's out of rockets. He's not moving in any direction that will give him more. I think he's handicapped a little bit by that. Not able to pursue or toss spam where he wanted to. So that all net solid a nice shiny mega health. 
Okay, we're switching over to solid now. Just wanted to make an operational note here. I am recording on my new rig, so we should be seeing some 1080p, 60 frames per second goodness coming out of this. Hopefully you all enjoy. You can also see the webcam down there in the bottom right-hand corner. But Solid moving fluidly gets the frag. Catches Dodger going for the mortar down on the base. Or bottom of the map, I should say. And he takes the armor at 15. I mentioned several times before, but uh, this being action-oriented FPS, it does help that both Megas are on a 30-second interval. It's just one less thing to worry about cognitively and instead putting all of your attention into the action. Dodger doing great damage as as Solid goes through the warp zone. Nets him a frag. He's back to a 5 frag lead with just about 6 minutes into this match now. Nice comboing and good timing uh, help Dodger survive, but you know, only barely. If you noticed, after the exchange and picking up the Mega, he only had 103 health, so otherwise, that could have turned out very differently if his timing were to be just a, just a second or two off. Okay, I think I heard that Vortex click, so he is out of Vortex ammo. I'm not sure if he's aware of it. Doesn't seem to bother him too much as he lands a nice amount of rocket damage. I think full damage would be 80 there. He netted 75. The way to be successful in, in most maps in this game is to know the common patterns of movement throughout the map. And also, don't get caught by surprise and shot in the ass. Um, that helps, too. Um, but back to the patterns of movement. So if you know the typical pathways or maybe observe which way your opponent is going after picking up a Mega, say if you're a down player, it's in your best interest to, to toss spam right along that same path because you'll end up getting some damage basically for free. And that's basically what you want. Okay, we're, we're following Solid here as he tries to climb back. A little bit of mistiming here on the Mega Health and a little bit of frustration showing uh, in his HUD. Maybe he changed his, his mouse config around or something, but clearly he's not hitting the shots that he wants to be hitting right now. That's unfortunate. He lands a shot, but he, he doesn't have the confidence to pursue in. Maybe he feels that Dodger is, is more stacked than he is. See a little bit of the waggling of the mouse there that says, Hey, I'm not happy with how this setup is, but I'm making do. So at this point, we have about a minute, a minute and a half remaining. Solid has five frags to cover. Um, so he's able to get all of these items, but it's all for naught because all we're seeing of Dodger at this point is just his rear end as he escapes down a corridor. And, and that's exactly what he should be doing. He doesn't have anything to do but run away and run out the clock to win this game. But he's caught out getting the 50 armor. One minute remains. Able to evade with a little bit of sneakiness there. Um, but that is probably the most risky spot on this map uh, for the down player. And Dodger is kind of the down player in terms of stack here. So if you go for that 50 armor if, and you're the, the person in control, it's always a good idea to just attack with the MG. It's kind of like too good of a situation. Like wide open area and hit scan spray of bullets so it ends up working working out really well anyway so dodger working on 
evading solid, solid working on closing the gap. Not working out so well for him. He's frustrated with the mouse, and he and he goes down it's nine to four. Looks like that's going to be a GG. There's no way he's going to get five frags in nine seconds. As we switch back to Dodger at this point. And there we have it, Dodger over Solid, 9-4 on the map, Final Rage. Uh, so, thanks for watching. Again, my name is Antibody, and this has been a dual commentary. Uh, so, if you want to see more of these, uh, send me some demos, or bug your favorite players to send me some demos, and I will do so. Um, but other than that, I will see you on IRC and the forums. So, happy fragging, and adios.